This is the ball caster, a metal ball that fits right into the socket like this. And if you do need to get it out, a quick tip is to use an axle pushed through the back to just pop it apart. The usefulness of this ball caster is that it rolls in any directions and can go over um, a whole variety of surfaces that perhaps the robot is unable to do. Here I've built a little robot that has uh, two wheels and rests right here along its front edge. However, that means that front edge is dragging as the robot moves along. And so ideally we would attach this ball caster right to the front in order to support it. The ball caster has a one point here and the temptation might be to um, use a black connector pin and put it into a beam which then could be connected here on the front. The downside of this though, while it does work, is that that ball caster is now lo is connected just by that one point and that's a weak connection point as you're driving around. Instead, one trick is to actually use, uh, instead of a, one of these beams, is to use these two connector pieces. Here we can actually connect them together like this and like such, and then connect that onto the front of our robot, which now adds two points of connection and is more sturdy for when the robot is driving around.